Hi, I'm Dennis Cometti. It's time to play Saturday afternoon football. It's good to be back. Boy, did I miss it here in Melbourne. Today, we've trekked to the MCG. A player who always knew how to find the goals and did so 800 times in his illustrious career. From my point of view, it's a delight to have him as part of the commentary team. Welcome, Richo. What a game we've got today, Dan. There's really been a big build-up for this clash. Today, it's the Blues versus the Lions. Brisbane are led by their captain onto the field of play. Banners ready for the players. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banner looks great and everything is spelt correctly. Mind you, I'm the last man to ask. Umpire tosses the coin. Brisbane kicking to the right of screen. Round three. Both these teams coming off wins. The siren is yet to sound. They say all things come to those who wait, but I'm starting to wonder if anyone will be around to hear it. And here's the bounce to launch the festivities. Cruiser taps. Right gets it on the bounce. Zorko guides it. Advantage, says the umpire. Approaching the goals now goes wide for a behind. Carlton by a point. We'll look for a quick option here. A pinpoint pass is the key. Graham there to mop it up. Puts the head down as he runs in. Cripps scores with a beautiful kick. That's his first. And we have the first goal of the match. And that goal is right off the top shelf for him. Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. First hand's important. The bouncing ball is controlled. The umpire will give us another ball up. Cruzic with the mighty fist. Guided down nicely by Wright. Pick up by Graham. Clean tap by Wright. Clean tap by Simpson. Taylor with the mighty fist. Takes control of the bouncing ball. Has it now. Picked up the ball. He has the ball. He shows the quick hands. Martin with the kick. That was all beans. He kicks with power. Murphy with the tap. He collects the loose ball. Sweeping handball. Lester puts it on the boot. Pat Roney in no hurry as he prepares for the kick. Strong mark. 35 metres out. Famous last words I know, but this is a goal he shouldn't miss. A goal for Brisbane. That will settle his nerves. The first goal is always welcome. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal. Hodge knows that was something special. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Martin wasn't even close to that tap, and he'd be crazy to think that type of effort will win any time soon. Buick feeds it wide. Handballs. Lester puts it on the boot. Hodge claims the ball. Hodge is incredibly competitive, and you can count on the fact that if he makes a mistake, apart from being dirty on himself, you won't see another one for a long, long time. He'll get a free kick. Kerno slams the ball to his boot. Rich with the tap. He gathers the loose ball, sends it on its way. 
The ball bounced favorably for Pasternak. The umpire says, give it to me. Prusik got a fist on it. He controls the bouncing ball. An easy interception for Martin. He brings it out of the pack. Hands like dinner plates. Kicks. Marked by Cripps. Cripps kicks it to the square. Nice contested mark by Cruiser. Cruiser feeds it wide. Graham claims the ball. Graham got a really good footballing brain. He gathers up the intercepted ball. Bastinac kicks it. He gets it under pressure. He's got a hold of that one. He takes the contested mark. Jams it on the boot now. Beams marks. 40 minutes from home, kicking from about a 30-degree angle here. To be generous, you'd say he was just wide of the mark with that shot. The scoreboard is level. March back, waiting for his teammates to break. They're using the Tokyo subway play. 30 meters out. Not the easiest of angles, this one. He's taking the shot from about 30 degrees. Point the difference. Marchbank assesses his options now. He's just trying to find a loose man in the defensive 50. Right. May not be the first guy you'd follow into battle, but you're glad that he's on your team, that's for sure. Puts boot to ball. Kerno marks the ball. Puts boot to ball. Lamb marks the ball. He boots it. He grabs it. Martin kicks. A great effort. He kicks quickly. Good mark by Murphy. Nothing presenting. He fires it to an empty space. The ball bounces to the advantage of the opposition. Zorko picks it up. He lays off the pass. McCluggage with a kick out of the pack. Plowman sends one up towards the wing. Almost a touch of synchronized swimming about that mark. One is the peg. McCluggage seems like he's enjoying his footy. I think he's going to be around for a long time. Cruiser puts his boot on it. The mark will be paid. He kicks the ball. Unfortunately, placed ball finds its way into the opposition's grasp. Chips it down towards half forward. Stuck the mitts out and held on to it. Boots it. Takes that one strongly. Oh, what a kick. Great hand. If they get this, they'll take the lead. The Blues back in front. This match is swinging back and forth like a metronome. Replays are great when you can see how talented these guys are at conjuring something out of nothing. Celebration time after that one for Kerno. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Big thump from Cruiser. Lamb boots it. Strong mark by Graham. Graham seems like he's enjoying his footy. I think he's going to be around for a long time. Right takes a shot. It's going. Right gets a huge goal. That replay shows just how good that goal was. Right with the goal, and he runs back into position. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Martin without a touch, the clearance by Cruiser. He gains possession, lest it with a low spearing kick. Beams gets the upper hand. He takes the shot. He holds his breath. Perfect kick. Beams getting his first. You get the feeling something big is brewing.
He'll kick. It's not a bad sort of a kick either. It's a goal. Beams with the goal, and he runs back into position. The Rucks prepare to go at it for this bounce. Here we go. Kruzik with the hit, with the ball now. Lamb just got cleaned up and sent back to Neverland. And over the boundary line she goes. The ball going back to the players right now. Kruzik nicely outclassing Martin. Somehow found more room on the boundary than Wayne Harms. Here's Richo with his stats. The tackling has been really equal in this match so far. The Lions, nine. The Blues, seven. Both teams are... The second term is underway. Never give up, never give in. And when the upper hand is yours, you may have the ability to win with the dignity that you absorbed the loss. Knocks it down in front. Clean tap by Glester. Bounces favorably for Cutler. Intercept by Bro. Exclamation point. How about that? Beams misses the goals. Less than one goal in this match. Brisbane still very much in it. Teammates scrambling to make a lead. March back. Kicking the ball to himself. Choose to kick it. And the ball goes over the boundary line. Throw in from the boundary line. The umpire has released the ball. Kruzik punches it. He has the ball. Don't know how he managed to get that out of the pack. Works it across the ground. The mark by Bright. Chips it down towards half forward. Taylor takes advantage. Slams it on the boot. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Matheson can achieve anything he sets his mind to. The sky is the limit for this guy. Martin just wanted it more then. He boots it. Kerno wins the contested ball. He boots it. Lobby with the mark. Gets boot to high. Kruzik looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. McCluggage puts it on the boot. Good mark by Matheson. Jams it on the boot now. Nice contested mark by Lester. Superb handball. Sends it on its way. Good tap from Christensen. Perhaps he was trying to audition for the ballet. Pat Rooney going for number one. Oh, tough throw. The Lions only trailing by less than a goal. We'll look for a quick option here. A pinpoint pass is the key. March back. It was more obvious than Shaquille O'Neal as an undercover cop. That's deliberate. Christensen with no time to delay with that kick. 40 meters out. Pat Rooney with a clinical drop punt. Rowe has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. A cool, calm head, clearing it out of defense. Good drop punt by Murphy. Cripps marks it. Cripps needs to work on his vertical leap because at times he can be found wanting when he's leaping for the ball. Puts boot to ball. Right with a strong mark. Right with the shot. Oh, and it's gone through for a behind. The Blues by four points. Taylor will take his time. He doesn't want to see it turn over and come back straight over his head. He picks up the loose ball. Shot by Kerner. Kerner just makes the goal line. The Blues lead the Lions. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first rate. Chernoak knows that was something special. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. Here's the bounce. Big thump from Martin. He controls the bouncing ball. He's got the football now. Jams it on the boot. Solid as a rock and he comes away with a lovely contested mark. Land with the tap. Lucky bounce collected. Slips the handball to Cripps. He's running hot, Richard. He's been outstanding all match, Dan. 
The ball is on the ground, and it's picked up by Mays. Taylor shoots off the handball. Mays sends one up towards the wing. Cherno with the tap, guided by Mullet. Matheson gathers it. He brings it out of the pack. Strong mark by Hodge. Puts boot to ball. Beams presents and takes the mark. 45 meters out. He's on a 30 degree angle, going for goal number two. He's missed it. Well, if the Hines were goal, this team would be very rich by now. Two goals can bring this back for Brisbane. Marchbank, he's good, but he doesn't always find that best option while in congestion. Marchbank, not trying to hide that one. Christensen lines up. He gets boot to the ball. It's a mark. He doesn't want to take too long lining this shot up. He slams that on the boot. Hodge with the spoil. Rory gets the ball, gives it to the running man. Slams it on the boot. Perfect timing from Fritz. Gets boot to high. Kruzik spills it. Martin with the kick. Beams was surrounded. He needed to mark it, and he did. Bumps the big skin. Great grab. Talking to a football doesn't do much good unless you do it while your opponent is lining up. Papaloni takes his shot at goal. Nice work from Papaloni. He sinks his first goal. Nothing separating these teams now. Lucky we have that goal recorded because it was first right. Smiles all round. Both Ruckman have their eyes on the ball. Look at that bounce. Kruzik thumps it forward. Clean hands with a difficult bouncing ball. Hand passes. Mullet hands it back to Lamb. Approaching the goals now. Ball heads out of bounds. Ball eyes on the ball as the Ruckman battle it out. Martin thumps it forward. Jams it on the boot now. Simply outplayed the opposition there. Zorko must have amazing intuition because he can react so fast to situations it's as though he's had premonitions. That's a mark. Matheson slams the ball to his boot. He takes a strong mark. Heads up the corridor. Beams has it. Kicks the skin off it. Takes it well. Kicked by Kerno. Zorko, the better man there. Kicks it. He wins the contest. Lamb sends one up towards the wing. Lodi takes an uncontested mark. Kruzik got under it. Boots it. Wright grabs that one. It's a nice piece of that one. Strong mark. Time to check the stats, Richard. Well, the scoreboard says they're winning, but you wouldn't have thought so looking at those stats. Hmm, that's pretty deep, Richard. It's half time, which means I can take a breather. Second half is underway. How you respond to the challenge in the second half will determine what you become after the game, whether you're a loser or a winner. Kicks it. Grips with the mark. Jams it on the boot. Almost a touch of synchronized swimming about that mark. Minus the peg. Simpson presents and takes the mark. Jams it on the boot. He's driven that ball hard, but it's a miss. Just a few points the difference. He's looking for options now. 
Knocked by Mays. Sends the Sharon on its way. Out of bounds near the 50. The Ruckman battle it out. Clean tap by Cruiser. Zorko dodging for no reason at all. Chip kick along the wing. Nice mark under pressure. Cutlick loves to take a screamer, and I think the coach won't mind him having a crack. But as he gets better and better, he'll provide real X factor for his team. Jones puts his boot on it. Mullet marks the ball. He gets boot to the ball. He gets it under pressure. Gets boot to high. The ball bounced favorably for Taylor. Jerno threading the needle right there. Simpson going for number one. Carlton with a healthy gap on the scoreboard, leading the Lions 33 to 23. Replays are great when you can see how talented these guys are at conjuring something out of nothing. Congratulated by his teammates. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. The bounce. Brisbane Caroni applying token pressure in the ruck. It's just not good enough as a result. The opposition are winning the match. He steadies now in front of goal. Hodge takes a shot. Now the kick is no good. Yet another behind. Marchbank looking for a lead. Kick to himself. That had some power behind it. A nice running mark. Looks like he panicked there. He wins the contest. Land with a low spearing kick. Almost a touch of synchronized swimming about that mark. That is the peg. Cruiser claims it. Cruiser can be very consistent. He does still need to do some more work to make sure he brings his A game to every match. Martin with the mark. He boots it. Just wasn't able to grab it cleanly. Grips with the tap. Lester taps. Land with the pickup. Mullet with the tap. Tap by Graham. Right decisively. Mays with the mighty fist. Head down now as he goes in for the goal. Solid as a rock and he comes away with a lovely contested mark. Nice kick. Carlton by 15 points. Lang has to stay committed. Then with a little bit of guts and determination, he should make something of his career. He's loving that replay, <laughs> and he's making sure his opponent knows all about it. Lang, happy. The Ruckmans steal themselves before the bounce. And there's the bounce. Martin gets the tap. Cameron gathers it. Kruzik feeds it wide. A good mark under the circumstances. Carlton could bypassing their four targets and having shots on the run with very few marks inside forward 50. Rich with the kick. Kerno with good strong hands. Jams it on the boot now. Wright takes it well. Wright feeds it wide. Graham gets the upper hand. Not a pretty drop cut, but it gets away okay. Concentration comes out of a combination of confidence and hunger. So they tell them. Rich looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Matheson with the mark. Puts boot to ball. And the mark will be paid. Chip kick along the way. Great grab. Cutlick really wears his heart on his sleeve. He kicks the ball. Lester marks the ball. He boots it. He gets the upper hand, lining it up with the goal now. Beams kicks the ball. He wins the contested mark. 50 metres out. Going for goal number two. The huge kick makes it to the goals. Hodge kicks number two. The Lions trailing by less than two goals. They're still in this. He's loving that replay, <laughs> and he's making sure his opponent knows all about it.
You can see it on his face. He's happy with that effort. The Ruckman steal themselves before the bounce. The bounce is straight up and down. Kruzik really gets onto this one. Gets a handball away. Moves it quickly by hand. Mullet approaching home now. He misses the mark. He passes the ball. Simpson. He bangs it through. The Blues by 15 points. Simpson has a nose for goals. You wouldn't want to bet against him even on the tightest of angles. There's one for the time capsule. Simpson happy. The Ruckman conscious of where their teammates are. They wait for the bounce. Martin can really set the tone of the game with his rough work. He just always gives his team first use of the ball. Mullet hits it. The ball is tapped. Cruiser with the spoil. Silvani with the spoil. Tap. Kruzik with the mighty fist. Good tap from Mays. The ball is slammed towards goal by Bright. He's got the footy in his hands. Jams it on the boot. He sneaks away for an uncontested mark. Nice hands. Choose to kick it. Good mark by Lester. Lester has been a solid contributor for this team. His coach will know what to expect from him week to week which really helps when structuring the team. He slams that on the boot. Mullet with a strong mark. Sending it on its way. Cruiser with the ball. He puts power behind that kick. He claims the ball. Perspiring like a putting in a pot as he lines the shot up. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. 40 meters out. An ideal position to be kicking from. Wright misses and gets it behind. Carlton leads by 16. Taylor has a fair kick on him. I expect him to roost this down the middle. Is there anything interesting in the stats, Richard? Terrible stats for Carlton, but they're getting results in the end. There's the siren for the final quarter, and play is underway. It's not over when you're losing terribly, it's over when you quit. Marked by Silvani, straight down the field. Simpson marks it. There's a vast chasm between him and the goals ahead. Taylor got under it. Choose to kick it. Pasternak, the better man there. Clean hands with a difficult bouncing ball. He seems to have the ball on a string, Richard. Yep, Dennis, he's a class act. Carlton could score the last two goals. Carlton leads by 22. The Blues are taking their time and looking for the safe marking option in the forward line. Most of their goal production is coming from set shots, and it's paying off for them. There's one for the time capsule. Silvani loves that. The Ruckman giving each other the ice-cold killer stare-downs as they wait for the bounce. Martin really gets onto this one. Clean hands with a difficult bouncing ball. Martin gets onto the ball. Lamb onto the ball. Lobby hand passes the ball. He kicks the ball. Strong mark there. He gets boot to the ball. No one around troubling him there. A long way out. Simpson with a 45 degree angle in front of him. Simpson slots the goal. Three goals so far. Well done. Carlton lead the Lions 58 to 30. The kick is about as straight as a shopping trolley, and it's a goal.
Simpson is relieved to see that one go through. Umpire has the ball, ready for the centre bounce. Punch by Cruiser. Buick sticks out his hands and collects the ball. A spearing kick from Mellet. A great effort. Silvanic with a perfect drop punt. Spilled by Cripps. That kick has covered a very long distance. Lester has a great set of hands. Fantastic mark. Marked by Beams. Gets boot to Leather. A big run to take that mark. Booted by Crow. Levy with the mark. The Blues are having shots for goal on the run rather than looking to hit targets inside 50. And why shouldn't they when they have so many quality kicks in the team? Cruiser with the kick. Strong mark there. Silvani kicks it. The mark will be paid. Jams it on the boot now. McCluggage looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. The ball being picked up before it makes its target. We get a ball up on the wing. Definitely palmed to advantage. Able to grab it on the half volley. He gives the ball away. Choose to kick it. Has he? Yes, he's paid it. Christensen boots it. Lester presents and takes the mark. Bumps the big skin. Great mark. Don't take too long lining up the goal. Invariably, the mind messes up more shots than the body. A great effort. Picked by Plummer. Steady hands there as he holds that one. A low stabbing kick. Great mark under pressure. Plowman, he's not the biggest threat on the field, but he can make his opponent accountable, and he requires a watchful eye at times. Leicester heading for goal. Forty minutes from home. He's on a 30-degree angle. A chance to add one more to his tally. Tantalizingly close. Behind. The goal eluding them each time. Might have to kick it to himself. Marchbank kicks to himself. Bumps the big skin. Good mark by Murphy. Choose to kick it. Levy looking a real threat out there when he pulls in contested marks like that one. Lamb is a great mark on the lead, but he can sometimes get worked under the ball in the contest. If he can lift his overhead capability, he will be a star. Matheson puts his boot on it. Lobby marks the ball. He slams that on the boot. It comes off hands. It gets tapped. Beams gets onto the ball. Zorko takes a shot. Misses for a behind. Brisbane just cannot get a goal. The Lions patrolling. March back. Waiting to bring it back into play. Gets boot to Leather. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. A mark by Zorko. Zorko. He's just got a lot of tricks in the bag which makes him so very hard to stop. He's also got an amazing highlight reel. Kerno with good strong hands, sending it on its way. Really solid use of the body to outmark his opponent. He boots it. There's no contest for that mark. Jams it on the boot. He had his eye on the ball all the way and took the mark well. He boots it. The mark will be paid. Nice torpedo cutler. A great effort. Goes up the line. Nice work from Beams. This will certainly test him from this distance. Takes it well. Christensen winds it up. 45 meters out. And he's kicking on a 30-degree angle. This could prove difficult for him. 45 meters out. Cutler will avert his paycheck if he converts this one. 30 meters out. Bob's getting accustomed to kicking goals. Danger signs for the Lions. The replay capturing everyone's attention. What a goal. Hodge loves that. A brief moment of serenity before the ball is bounced and the Ruckman unleash. Cruiser hits it. He controls the bouncing ball. The discipline Brisbane has shown out there has been great. The Lions have barely cocked up a free kick but I think that's reflective of their intensity to the ball. I'd like to see them lift their hunger levels.
and the ball goes out of play. Tack. Cripps. Has the ball. He gets a fist to it. Mullet. Gets the ball. Passes by hand. The Blues certainly deserving of that win. Richo to wrap up the match. Well, that's just a shocker from the Lions. Red hot favourites with the bookies, but big losers here today. The stats don't lie. They never looked in the hunt all day, and there'll be some soul searching back at the club this week. Final scores are 58 to 38. Well, that's it. I'll let Richo say the goodbyes. It was great to be here, Dennis. I'll be back next time. Thanks for joining us. As always, it's been a pleasure. We look forward to seeing you back soon.